All right. Hey, everybody. I'm here with one of my favorite clients, Ishwar. Um, Ishwar went through the program. I remember, I think you started back in like September, and then we stopped working either in February or March of this year, right? Right. Yeah, we started late August. In late August. Yeah. I love it, man. And it's been, it's been a lot of fun seeing you transform. So walk us through, like, what were your results being in the program? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I think like the biggest thing for me is like how I have changed, like both appearance wise, but like also how I feel day to day. Like I was, when I started, I would say I was not obese, but like I was still had a significant amount of body fat and I was in a position where I would train, like just go to the gym and do what I felt that day but really didn't know all the ins and out and everything about like nutrition calorie and throughout this program like i have learned about like nutrition i've learned about weight training and like how to properly manage your program and like how to train for like gaining mass but on the other side i've become like way leaner i would say like i'm very close to like 10 to 12 percent body fat right now <laughs> that's amazing that's not a lot of people can say that after quarantine, especially who live in New York City. <laughs> like New yeah. York City guys. And, and, and I think one of the most amazing part while I was coaching you was like, we were getting these amazing results while you were in, you were in Queens or Brooklyn? I Like, I know you're one of the- Yeah, I mean, it's like, Brooklyn. Yeah, so it's like, most people can't say the same, right? Most people at like quarantine really hit their health hardest. So. Kudos to you, man. How many pounds did you lose? Do you remember? I, uh, yeah, I think around 27, 28 pounds. 27, 28 pounds. That's amazing. And what was your favorite thing about the program? I think the best part is like how you have structured, like how you work with everyone individually. And it's not like you understand, it's not like one size fits all and how I need to work with you to understand all these like intake and how you have like really structured, okay, this is what this week should look like. So I really mm -hmm. liked, I'm a type of person who enjoys like structure. Like if there's a structure, it's easier to follow for me. And it really helped me understand, okay, this is what I needs to be done. And I was just like checking the boxes like day to week to week. And of course, like there were times when it was harder to check those boxes, but there yeah. was like a backup plan for it. And um, that really Love helped that. me reach the goals. Yeah, totally. I think a lot of the time people think that, you know, I know what to do. I just need to do it, but they're not doing it. And years after years, they're not doing it still. What happens is what they're really missing is the step-by-step. -step. Like they just don't have enough clarity on what exactly to do. They're like, yeah, I just need to go to the gym. I'm like, what are you going to do at the gym? Like, like, <laughs> you just do a barbell <laughs> curl and run on the treadmill. You'll get tired on day two. Uh, but like you were saying earlier, like the way that the workouts are structured and now you're still, you're still continuing to get shredded. Like looking at you when I saw you today, I was even happier. Uh, Cause that's the, as a coach, that's my biggest reward. When I see clients sustain those results, even after they graduate the program. So very good, man. What would you tell anyone who's like on the fence about joining training with the Titans? any advice uh, for them because I, I like for you you were special because we talked like a year or two years prior and you decided not to do it but then you came back so what would you tell someone that's on the edge of, of joining or that's thinking about it right um yeah that, that's a very good question actually i think you reach like we talked about this whole fitness process like a year back um i think it was like exactly about a year and I had just like started working. And I mean, by the time I, I was a person who would go to the gym, but it wasn't like a regular habit for me. Like I didn't really um, see at that point in time, maybe like I was thinking about, okay, maybe I can do it myself. I'll just watch some videos on YouTube or I'll just read about it. But, you know, it's actually like, people study these things and like there's so much that goes into place and of course like you could study but then like why not hire expert right like if you get sick you go to a doctor and you get treated right like I'm not saying this is sickness but like if you want to improve yourself yeah. like go to an mm -hmm. expert 
who knows how to do these things. And yes, maybe it, it will be a bit expensive or like costly, mm-hmm. like, it, but at the end of the day, like that's for you, right? Like if you want mm-hmm. to wake up in the morning and like feel better and like before maybe you go to the shower and you like see yourself in the mirror and like how you want to feel, that it really impacts your entire day, like the confidence. 100%. Um, so like hire an expert who knows and Mo is the absolute expert here. So I highly recommend Thank you. him. Yeah, and I think you either in life, you either pay with time or you pay with money, right? Like, I mean, it, looking at you and looking at other clients, it's like, we can just fast track you to there, right? We can leapfrog you. So where you're at right now, even if it takes us four months instead of like three months, or even it takes us five months, we still leapfrog you five years. So like now you know so much more and you know, now you're happy. Last question for you, because I know you're a, you're a very busy professional. What, like when you got in the best shape of your life, how has that influenced you in your corporate America career? Like, do you notice more confidence? Did you notice more energy? Like did anything change on that side or was it just purely the look? Um, but yeah, that's a good point. I mean, of course, like it's still COVID, so I'm not like have interacted with that many people, but I mean, I, I can speak about like my day to day. I think I definitely have like more focus and energy and like I bring, I would say like hundred percent of myself, or even if I'm like doing Zoom call with my team members or clients. So I think that has definitely changed, like how I present myself and how I bring myself uh, on these calls. I love um, it. But yeah, I I can see like this impacting how I interact with people in the future when I'm like meeting people in person. I love it, brother. Very good. Thank you so much, Ishwar. Appreciate you. Yeah. All right, everybody. Today I'm here with Melina. Melina has been a client for the last six to nine months, right? Um, you're an amazing client. And yeah, Melina, tell everybody what were your results like in the program, where you started and where you are right now. Yeah, so I started uh, overweight. Um, in general, not super athletic. I used to be in high school. So my goal was to kind of get back to where I was in high school, very athletic and much more in shape, lower weight. I'm in fitting into like clothes again. And uh, overall, I think I met those results. <laughs> yeah. And- so I've, I've gone down like two sizes, which has been fantastic. Um, I just feel like I have better endurance. You know, I was able to do 10 mile hikes, you know, six months into this program and I could not have done that before. 10 mile so. hikes, two sizes down, 25 pounds down. It's all good. Yeah. It's all good. And <laughs> I remember when you started, we, yeah, so that was like peak of COVID. So gyms were closed. And we started working out at home and I don't even think you had any equipment at home. We were working with the resistance bands for a minute, right? Yeah. <laughs> How was that for you? Do you remember that part? I, I much, I remember that part. I much prefer the gym, but it was good. It was definitely a good start. It made the gym less intimidating when I got there. Yeah. Were you like, were you going to the gym before you started the program or never? Um, I used to go like back in high school and then like, or college but then I stopped so got it got so it's it. been a while were you intimidated <laughs> in the beginning because that's I, I do hear that from my female clients um when they first start going to the gym they're a little intimidated but like if they have a little transition period where they are in the habit of working out they go to the gym it's a lot easier right yeah for sure and, and when I used to go to the gym like years ago it was like to the cardio section maybe to the machines that I never did free weights which was kind of the nerve-wracking part Um, And I felt much better after kind of getting used to the movements with the resistance bands. It kind of just makes you feel more comfortable with the movements in general. I love it. I love it. And and how was it, uh, the workouts that I designed for you? Do you love them? Great. They were fantastic. I liked, you know, there was one time we had to modify because I just missed the leg days so much. And like, that was just like an instant modification. It was fantastic. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. And I think that's one of the advantages of being in a program like this is like some people assume that they're going to join program someone's going to give them pdf and be like go on your own but um like we stay in touch it's like if a client says something we we make changes pretty quickly uh so i love that um and then yep we lost 20 pounds what was 25 pounds what was your favorite part about the program for me it was the continuous learning there were 
frequent presentations, frequent discussions, and just constant feedback and learning, right? Sometimes I feel like people just give you a bunch of information up front and expect you to just know it and, you know, continue on. And I felt like we are continuously learning and improving. And that's my favorite. So good to hear. <laughs> so good to hear. So good to hear. So what would you tell someone that's like been wanting to join, but they're on the edge of joining? And like, what, what would you tell that person? I would say anyone could look stuff up. Nothing. It doesn't motivate you. It doesn't actually teach you everything. There's so much false information that everything here is designed to help you. And it, and it works, right? It worked really well. And there was a lot of, uh, for me, like a lot of motivation and a lot of uh, keeping me in check, which is something I couldn't do myself. And that was necessary to make the changes. I love it. So. Yeah. I mean, the free information, like reading something on, on a web page, like doesn't do anything. There's no. No. You know? And how do you know if it's true, right? Anybody can post stuff online. Yeah. And, then, and there's no like accountability. There's no plan. There's no community. There's no consistency. Um, and there's no like step-by-step -step guidance, right? Like uh, like part of when you join the program, you got access to my app, you got the step-by-step -step workouts. Everything is like, I take the thinking out of it. So like your job just becomes to execute. I think that's the beauty of it. Whereas a lot of time people are looking up stuff online. They don't really believe in it. So they kind of give it 10% effort. Then they're like, I don't get results. They give up and then they rinse and repeat. Um, right. But I love it. I love it. Thank you so much, Melina. Truly appreciate you. Thank you.